Today, Eggie is going to make stew. Yeah. You're going to need some ingredients. We've got a potato. We've got some leek. I got a bit of parsnip. I do like a bit of mushroom as well. Mm. Onion. Uh, sweet. And carrot to make you see in the dark. We also got some beef. Mmm. This is the pan I'm going to use for the stew, so I'm going to do it all in here. So I'm going to start off with a bit of oil. Which is the old olive oil. What I'm doing now is the meat in. Oh, the big bits. I might chop a few of them up. Big bits on. Depending how you like it, isn't it, I suppose. But a bit too big for me. Some of these. This has cost me two pounds. Um, from the butcher's counter. In my local store. I find it's better quality than the packets. And it's cheaper than the packets you buy. Uh, as you can see, the juices are starting to come out now. Brown, lovely. So I'm going to add the onion now. There you go, onion in. I can brown a bit with it. Put my onion in. Now that's doing quite well, that. Um, as you can see, I think it's nearly all browned on the outside. It's good, it's good, good. What I tend to do now... Of course, you, you make your stews how you want at home, don't you? Get um, this is a bovril. Um, you can use oxo. I got half a bovril. I'm gonna smother that in now. Actually, half of it. I'll tell you why. Because it flavours the meat now as it cooks. So stir that in, and it'll just give that beef a little bit of a kick, a meaty kick, you know, for tasting. Lovely. Yeah? We'll just let that go for a few minutes. And then we'll add the water. That's been going nicely now for a few minutes, so I'm going to add my water. Should be my stock. <coughs> Give that a stir. Right, what I need to add now is some goodies. Let's add some goodies to it, shall we? Right, we like carrot, don't we? Yeah. Well, um, carrot can go in. In you go, carrot. In you go. And cook away. Cook away for today. There we go, carrots in. Um, we do like a bit of sweet, don't we? So we'll put that in as well. There you go, sweet, in you go. Bye bye, sweet. Cheerio, Eggy. Right, sweet in. Let's give that a little bit of stir. As you see, <coughs> the more I put in, the more the water level goes up. So be careful. <laughs> um, and next, we're going to put um, Peter Parsnip in. There you go, Peter. You go in there. And Lily Leak. Off you go, Lily. There's Lily Leak in. And all I'm left now is potato and mushies. Um, I'm not going to add them yet. I'm going to let this cook a bit. My mate, Marmite. Now, this is optional, of course. Don't have to put this in at all. But I like a bit of marmite. Not a lot in a stew. It's a quite a big pan of stew, but I'm gonna put that much in. And stir it in. Stir it in. Stir your mate in, marmite. He wants to be in there. 
because you know he's your mate and it's best to have your mates close to you so what better way than in your stew than in your stomach that's what I say look my mate he's gone yeah I'm gonna put a bit of um oops oregano in don't know why like it and this is a bit of a mix of different ones because I haven't got much in like I said so I'm gonna use quite a bit of this so because I haven't got much of the others there you go uh, last not least you've got your other half of the cube the bottle cube so you can throw him in as well crumble him in not very crumbly I must say it's very sticky uh, get your wooden stirrer stir it around around and around looking good it's, it's looking good I tell you don't know what it tastes like yet, because I'm going to have a taste in a minute. Always best to taste your stew as you go along, I say. And you'll know what you want in it. I've got no pepper in it yet, but I will be doing some black pepper soon. Um, yeah, so that's looking good. Black pepper. Um, I've only got the ground one. I do prefer the coarse, actually. But ground one's still pepper. So in you go pepper, put as much as you want in, voila, you've had a, oh that's no good, can't put that in there, um, <laughs> you want to put wrappers in there mate, no, right, it's looking alright that now. This is a song I wrote and it's called Stew, Stew. I just added some of this. It's entirely up to you. Hop, oh, goblin, hop, oh, goblin. <laughs> I just added a bit of that into here. It's thickened it up just the way I like it. Yeah. Just thicken them juices up. There's a bit too many juices, otherwise. There we go. And if it's, if it's too thick, you can always add a bit of water to it. So, I'm just going to taste that now. Oh yeah, look. It's come, come up lovely now. Um, tell you what, you have a go first. What's it like? Okay. Nice? Mmm, it isn't it? Oops, it's just a camera. I'll have a go now. Ooh, it's blowing up. Oh yeah, oh superb! And there we have it, a nice stew with some crusty bread and butter. Mmm, talking, I say talking.